In this video, I'm going to show you what it takes to install this Injora front brass disc diff cover onto the Traxxas TRX4M. If you're new to the channel, welcome. My name is Troy. This is Roadside RC. You'll tend to find me bashing and crawling or drifting or racing, plus doing product review videos and how to's. Today, very simple, very quick video, all about adding a little bit of brass to the front of the TRX4M. First step is to get the body off. Then we're gonna flip the truck over and with a one and a half millimeter driver, we're gonna take out these screws that hold the rear link, the front link mounts on. Now we did that so that we could easily get these links up and out of the way. You can then use that same one and a half millimeter driver to get these four screws from the back of the pumpkin. You have one here one on this other side and then one on the top the bottom from this angle but top of the truck on both down right here with all of those screws loose the front diff case just literally slides right out now you may need a small pair of needle nose in order to get these screws out you do not reuse the same screws into the new diff case the new diff cover does come with its own screws. Now you will be doing metal into a metal, so I do suggest that you use Loctite. The new diff case just slides right on. It can only fit one way. You really just can't screw it up. Again, just a small amount of Loctite there on the end of that screw before you push it in. And just like that, you've now added a little bit of extra weight to the front of the truck just to help it crawl that little bit more. Really, really easy, simple upgrade to your truck. Now, you can buy them in a pair, so you can do one for the rear. I'm not personally a fan of that. I'm personally of keeping all my weight in the front and the rear as light as possible, but you have that choice if that's what you so desire. I hope this video was useful for you. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down in the comments. Otherwise, if you have any other ideas about a TRX-4M, I have a playlist over here of the TRX-4M and adventures I've had with it and other modifications that have been done. So you can come over and check that out. Thank you and goodbye.